Hello there folks, I'm Dan Brown from a sort of interest in life.com and today we're going to head out for the first time ever on a 2014 Mango Bike single speed. I've got it set up as a simple single speed free wheel rather than the proper fixed gear and yes it is this absolutely beautiful blue and orange creation that you're looking at. As usual this is a customised uh, paint job that I chose off the website and well I thought I've got to go down to the delivery office and collect a parcel, so why not take the opportunity to do a good trip, a little bit urban, going through the industrial estate, and then take the long route home, a very long route home, that cons consists of travelling in the exact opposite direction, uh, to just get a little bit of countryside scenery. And that's some lovely backdrop footage to have a general chat about my first impressions. So, as some of you will know from particularly that opening clip even in this video, that I've got a room full of mango bikes at my mum's house at the moment. One of them is a fixie that I've been riding from mango bikes for about a year and a half. This one here is set up just as a normal single speed bike and there's also the silver bike that's a 18 speed uh, black series road bike from mango. And first of all, I absolutely love them all. But because I've been riding a Fixie for a year and a half, I'm obviously very used to having only one gear. So to hop on a brand new bike from Mango and be able to have that proper sort of the new feeling of everything being as perfectly in line and crisp and in tip top condition is fantastic. There's a very few uh, minor details that have changed over the last year or so with the general Mango Bikes design. The only one that's really noticeable to me personally is the bullhorn bars are now slightly different. There's uh, the bend in the bullhorn is slightly lower down or the horns are longer. So basically there's a little bit more tilting upwards after the little kink, which for me personally, I think uh, better than the previous ones as it gives you more to sort of lean against and it really fits in well with the way that I tend to ride the bike so that's something that I absolutely love that just getting on this bike today it's I mean it looks fantastic the blue it's easily the best looking bike that I've owned by miles the blue and orange when I was uh, playing on the website with the different setups and colors and customizing bits and pieces I just thought if this looks half as good in real life as it does on the website, then this is going to be fantastic. And it really, oh, it's just great. I don't mean to dwell too much on the colours or anything like that, but because this is a simple single speed bike, there's not much that I can really say and talk about in terms of the general first impressions because it's so simple and everything is just perfect on it. It's everything that you need the bike to be. It runs really smoothly. You don't have any issues with the chain or anything like that. Like I say, it's a simple drivetrain mechanism. One cog at the front, one cog on the back and a chain in between. Absolutely fantastic. As I say, I've been riding a Fixie for over a year and a half now. So I'm more than happy and more than satisfied with the single speed experience. And to basically be able to hop on a brand new one, it's Oh, it's just great. I absolutely love it. And this is probably one of my favourite bikes of, well, ever. <laughs> so that's been a gushing uh, quick impressions from my first ride on the Mango Bikes Fixie, or single speed driver. Check out my other videos because as you can imagine, there's plenty of biking. There's plenty more biking to come and little tutorials and videos of this, that and the other. So stay tuned, subscribe, and I will see you back on the bike very soon. Farewell.